Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Parasite Eve. I'm your Game Master, Darius. You'll notice that this is very the beginning of the game, and that's because it is. This is just after the whole incident thing with the reporters and all that fun stuff. So, this is the earliest point that you can enter the Chrysler building. It is only available in EX mode, which is basically New Game Plus, where you hold on to all of your weapons. Uh, well, the weapons that you selected and everything that was in your uh, storage at the time. So, the only real difference between EX mode and in-game mode is the fact that you are back to level 1. All your weapons are still super powered and all that fun stuff, and all the enemies in this mode are now just a little bit tankier, just a little bit harder. I don't know if it gives you more experience points for them, but yeah. So, I'm... I think I'm like level 4, level 5 at this point, and I just want to have a glimpse as to what is in the Chrysler building. I've already saved, so. The Chrysler building. A glimpse, a taste, a morsel, if you will, of the pain that is to come. Here's the Chrysler building. I've never been. So as far as I understand, I guess I need a key. Uh, as far as I understand, you can come and go from the Chrysler building as you please, but there's like checkpoints every 10 levels, I think. So, uh, yeah. Kind of wondering why the hell there's no monsters so far. There we are. Well, let's have a taste, a sampling of what's to come. Hey, these are the raptors from the end of, uh, first chapter. Not first chapter. Ah. All right. Ah, right, blinded. Oh, Lord. Come on. Come, seriously? Thank you. Wow. Alright, game. Thanks for that. Hmm. Bats. They're gonna be a joy. And yes, we do still get... Ex oh, sorry. Level 7. We still get experience and whatnot. Which is grand. But again, since we're so low a level, we're not going to be able to just spam the ever-loving crap out of spells to heal and whatnot. We gotta rely somewhat on items. Uh, that said, that bad dies first. Oh, okay. Yeah, they did make it so as... Uh, some of the in-game enemies are weaker. Just chug back at the medicine. I'm glad the least the enemies are giving me medicines. Let's try and down here. I think that was the wrong way to go. So pretty much any time that I find a bat or flying enemy, I'm just gonna... that. <laughs> I'm not gonna take any of that. So, one of the other differences between uh, EX mode and regular mode. At the end of each day, you'll also be awarded a buttload of uh, bonus points, which is great. I don't think I need to worry about... I think this is making me go in a circle. But that is, for the most part, it. Somewhat tougher enemies. You're back at level one. Uh, and now you have access to the Chrysler building and all the stuff that was in your storage when you had finished the uh, first game. I feel like I went in a circle, but I didn't go in a circle. And I don't know how hard this place is supposed to be. Again, we're only on the first level of so far. 
in reality what I'll probably want to do is go through more of the game until I get to a, a good grinding spot, more than likely back at the museum at the end of the game, uh, before I face off against Eve. And then from there, just, you know, grind my heart's content. Which honestly shouldn't be all that big of a deal. There's that. So uh, I, mm. I'm a little lost. Just when I already came from this direction. Probably already did. Yep, oh, another bat. Lowered a shotgun. Oh, popped my neck. I want to see how far I can at the least get uh, how I am now. That said, I'm probably not going to get too, too far thinking about it. Especially with the random encounters, actually, random encountering. That said, I also don't think I brought that much ammunition because I quite literally was like, hey, I'm gonna go do this thing really quickly to see how it's how it's gonna go. How much ammo do I have? Oh, I didn't even I didn't even remember to put away these uh, keys. Oops. I was just that eager. Alright, let's try the other direction then. Might also be asking, Dara, are you still up from when you had been recording the last episode? Yes. Alright, there's the elevator. Door? Or door? What door? Creepy. PE2. Using that basically right away. Limited space in my inventory and whatnot. Defense. P226. What a shit. Yeah, that's all, already a pretty big boon. Uh, I'm also just gonna... Boop. There's a bevy of freaking supplies and whatnot in this area, too. A whole lot of other weapons with different abilities and whatnot. Okay. I'm gonna hit that elevator, see if it's going to lead up or to my doom. Probably up and to my doom, if anything. Uh, guess I need a key. Okay. So I need a key in order to continue? Hmm. Maybe the Chrysler building is going to be a little bit harder than I thought. I mean, this is no indication of how hard the Chrysler building is right now. It's I've quite literally first floor. Oh, this looks special. Hey, second floor. Okay, so I need to find a key in order to use the elevator. Again, I think it's every ten floors that you have a boss. I could be wrong. I really need to look more into this whole thing. I just was really itching to try out New Game Plus slash uh, this. Man, that was a whiff of like five separate shots. Oh yeah, that's pretty much what I, uh, what I know of 
EX mode slash the Chrysler building. There were some other weapons that I'm probably going to cannibalize their abilities onto my shotgun. But other than that, eh. Just slaying monsters, make my way. Weird angle. Elevator. <coughs> Damn it, crossroads. Also, I have no clue. Uh, I need to find the information about this. If it is a thing or not. But I have no clue whether or not the maps are randomly generated. If they are... Balls. If they're not... Then I might just look up the maps, if I'm going to be 100% honest. Because I know some of the challenge of it is going to be, hey, see if you can beat 77 freaking levels of the Chrysler building. At which point my brain just kind of goes, no, no thank you. Especially if they're random. If they're random, though, at the least, all I need to do is just power level my ass until I can obliterate everything. I did not find you before. Oh. Terrible things. A bat. Oh. Yeah. Suck shotgun. I'll take my medicine. I've taken some damage. Let's go ahead and just uh chuck a couple of them. Range plus one. Yes. Uh bullet cap. Bullet capacity. Yes, please. Rockets for the rocket launcher. And a tool. Alright. Don't need a good chunk of those. And the ones that we did need, we already applied. <sighs> this is already an interesting thing, an, an interesting idea. Like, the take of a mega dungeon um, for a modern game. The game set in a modern setting. Alright, what's this? Level 3? Also, fun fact, my PlayStation 3 controller's analog stick is getting a little bit weird. Like it's staying stuck on it being up. Which is... Ugh. Oh, I didn't even notice the crows. Of note, too, um, from what I found, most places would suggest that if you're going to grind for the junk, do so here with the crows. Level up. Learn detox. I'm not going to bother with that. Because I've already got the best weapon in the game, don't at me. Uh, probably want to continue upping my capacity. He says, immediately pumping more into the freaking attack. I'm wondering now just how hard the first boss, at the least, is going to be. Very curious as to how the hard, how how the hard, yes, how hard it's going to be. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, Halo. 
Come at me, scrub rewards. I'm ripped. Well, I am so glad that the game's like, hey. Uh, it, it gives me a chance to dodge. That's that's the important part right there. Dodging is good. All right, place is pretty straightforward so far. I just don't come back this way. Continue to be straightforward. Allow me my sanity. Damn it. Honestly, I'm kind of amazed. Uh, I I was doing my recording session today into this morning, uh, kind of assuming that I was going to get only to the last chapter and then be exhausted. But I guess when you drink nearly an entire pot of coffee uh, in one sitting, you know, you just... Just find the energy. <laughs> it ain't healthy. Don't don't live like I do, kids. Full of anxiety and coffee. All right. There's gonna be another enemy in here. No. Bullet cap. I do like having more bullets from my gun. The one that matters. Also, reload. Wow. Cap of 28. Offense plus 4. Hell yeah. And offense plus 1. I didn't even level up, and my gun is now nearly just, just a good sneeze to level 100, or to 200. I think I should probably start upping my, um, vest, my armor. All right, so I think the general rule is that the stairs are going to be 100% of the time on the north facing wall of wherever I'm going, of whatever place, y'all. So if it's not this way, it's going to be Back the other direction and then straight up. Probably should have checked those first. Okay, there's the elevator. Just need the stairs. That's a dead end. This is fine. Honestly, it's more chances to level up, which I'm not going to turn down. For all I know, though, I might be missing. No. Ugh. It's very much leading me this, that, this way, that way, the other way. Please be a giant circle. Nope, not a circle. Maze, I haven't run into another random encounter yet. In quite a few screens. Wish. Wait. Oh, nope. There it is. Haha. On to level four. I'm actually making pretty good progress as far as I'm concerned. But what I'll probably do is I'll try to get to level ten. Uh, inevitably die and realize, oh shit, I have to go back from floor one. And then from there, uh, continuing the story a good chunk of the ways. Yep. Melt them. Yeah, I'll continue the story a good chunk of the ways, get myself some grinding done, and that way, at the least, I don't have to worry about dying too much. Oh, oh wait, that's the storage room. I nearly passed up the storage room. I'd have felt silly. 
I do have two revives, which I think are used automatically. Offense plus two. Inventory's full. I will not... Re and not. Didn't realize I had not used the uh, medicine. There we go. Uh, quit the bead. Sounds like a good plan to use. Another tool. UPS negative two. Um. I'm going to do myself a favor. I'll tune up my Avenger with it. And just take the stats. Because more range. I already don't really need that much more range, I don't think. I think as we're in the Chrysler building, it's mostly hallways. But if something is on the other side of the screen, then at the least, you know, I can shoot it. Speaking of things on the other side of the screen. Yeah. Posh posh. Who who needs who needs checkpoints? Who needs save points? All I need is the capability of taking shotgun. I can see shotgun being a bad idea. Uh what with its firing rate. But on the other hand, I don't care that much. Uh, the shotgun is... is fantastic. Alright, let's try this way first. We've already hit the supply closet, unless there's, like, multiple supply closets per level. That's a dead end. Great. Unless there's multiple supply closets, like, per level, then I'm not gonna worry too much about it. Seventy-seven floors. Seventy-seven floors. Hello, elevator. I'd like some stairs. I probably could just, you know, uh, use a map. Assuming that there are any. Who's crazy enough to map out 77 floors of madness I don't know there's some pretty insane people out there all right this is the fifth floor I might see afterwards if there are because I'd, I'd like to be able to at least get to the tenth floor before uh not the end of this video. Oh, there are random encounters in these corridors. What do we got? Hello, crow. Crows. Good level up, though. Well, I say good level up. It was not really that much of a level up. It was just meh. Um, because it was me, I'm just gonna pump it into item capacity. I suppose one of the other reasons I would want to get further in the game before getting higher than the 10th level in this is uh, being able to find and get and use, rather, medicine 3s and 4s. Because, you know... Not only will things be hitting me for more than my current health, let's be honest. Oh. Uh, let's take that medicine too. Because you never know. But yeah, things will be hitting me, so not only will I want to have more HP, I need to heal that more HP. What am I on? Fifth floor? 
rats and crows so far. All right. Four treasures. Inventory is full. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? Uh, discard at least one more medicine. Another tool. Ah. I don't know how many times I've found an M19. I, can I just... I can't. That hurts. I guess I'll discard another medicine one. No. <laughs> I don't need all these tools. Okay, SP Vest 2. I can at the least use a tool to upgrade my current vest. With that, just to get it out of my inventory. Then I can take the tool. I probably should have done that in the first place. And again, I will be able to collect uh, items throughout the rest of the game that we have been given, or that we can find. Same guns, same weapons. Or same guns, same armor, same medicines all over the place. Monsters, I assume, are still going to drop whatever the hell that they have. Floor six. I feel like we're doing pretty good. He says, not knowing that floor six might be his inevitable doom. Maybe I do need to play, uh, clean my PlayStation 3 controller here. It's got a little bit of gunk. I don't even know where the hell it came from. Like, I've been playing this game the last few hours. I had no problems pressing up. And now, as I'm traversing through the terrible, terrible Chrysler building, I'm finding pressing up and it will go, it will get stuck. Wait, did I find the way up already? Hell yeah. No problem. Who knows, maybe if I do that enough times, I can get up to 10th floor relatively fine. Maybe I can do it this particular video. Give me a quick second, though. I want to double check if I'm right about the checkpoint thing. I'm not finding anything that says there isn't, but I could just be lying. Lying out of my teeth. And yes. The every floor except every ten floors is randomized. Uh, I had my hopes up that that was actually a door, not a door, ears. So I think it is a situation where we can come back once we get the key to whatever floor we want. Uh, what did I just say, Matt? Like there's something off screen. Ow. There we go. More junk. Yeah, this place is easy. He says, really hoping that the, that saying to that just doesn't come back and bite him in the ass. Damn it. Watch it be every flipping look hello. Come on. Yeah. Ooh, more medicine. Yes. Down, thank you. Again, hate using the analog stick for this. <clears throat> but it's honestly the best way to move because there's no auto run when you use the d-pad gotta hold circle which is oof. 
Understandable, but I'd rather hold circle to walk than to run. Watch my inventory be full for all of this. God dang it. Oh, just a bat. All good. We don't need another medicine one. We really don't need another medicine one. Uh, that said, I'll go ahead and use a medicine one. PE4. Yes. Uh, Kev jacket. It kind of pains me. One second, let me look at this thing. Yeah, no, it sucks. I am going to simply discard it. And a tool. Of course. Well, I'm going to go ahead and call an episode here. When we return, I'm going to at least get to level 10 and then get the frick out of here because I'm worried I'm pushing my luck. So thank you everyone so very much for watching. I hope you're all enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And as always, I hope to see you folks in the next video. Take care. Cheers.